that is what's up for today guys we have some minnows some live bait we're gonna come out here to this beautiful pond this is a gorgeous pond got some real big fish in it big crappie big large mouth and we're gonna float these minnows around we're also gonna be throwing bass lures and jigs probably just everything in between so stay tuned let's see what we can get on these minnows we might catch and cook something i don't know yet we will see how today goes all right guys so what i'm doing today is i got about a 10 foot crappie rod four pound monofilament We've got some bass minnows big old shiners and i got these real bright colorful jig heads I almost always put my minnows on a jig head why i don't know it keeps them tilted at a certain angle i feel like they stay on there a little better and it gives them a little flash a little color under that i got it about three and a half to four foot long depth bobber so i'll throw it way out there in the middle of nowhere like that and just wait for that bobber to do something interesting i'll get back to y'all when it goes down See what happens. I think he's gonna leave it alone. Nope, he's trying. He is trying his hardest out there. I think he's got it. He's just swimming around with it. Oh, you're getting eight too, Drew. Since we left down the hole, guys. I don't know. Our minnows just might be strong with the force. Oh. Mine's getting a little stronger with the force, guys. Oh. I don't know what I should do. Oh, oh. Oh, he likes that. Oh, he's going to come back towards me. Oh, look how strong that is. Got him, guys. Oh, he came off, and that felt huge. Drew, you're getting really picked on. Dang. You got to give him more time, Drew. We are eight. He's taking my bobber under. Make sure he has enough time to eat that minnow before I set the hook. He's still holding it. He's holding through. I'm going to reel all the way down to him and give him a flick. And we are hooked up, guys. And if that ain't a bass, that is a slab crappie. It's got a little weight behind it though. Couldn't see this crappie rod. He's hooked. Oh, that's not no crappie, guys. Unless he's a state record. It's a, it's a bass. So much fun in this ultra light. Look at that fish right there, guys. Got him by the skin of his lip. You don't see how long that had him take it. Oh, he's on a log. That's a good one. Healthy looking. Oh, 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 calm down, my friend. You're getting all muddy. Look at that large mouth, guys. That is a real pretty one right there. Ate the minner on the jig head almost immediately after putting it back out there. I don't know if it's the same one. I bet there's a school of them, but we're going to get a release on this guy. Well, I had a pretty good bite, and I just cast that minnow back out. I think he's still dragging her. My minnow's really strong. It's going to be that 10-pounder and the 4-pound mono. Think we can do it? I don't. Drew says he'll get in the water for him. He jumped down the bank the other day for a brown trout for me, so I believe him. Oh, there he goes. Oh. He said, no, that minnow's just a bit too big for me. Right? Don't play with your food. Eat it like you mean it. There you go. He said, I got it. It's mine now. Nope. nope. He said, I'm not going to eat it. Probably could have set the hook on that one. He's coming back for it. Got him. I don't know, I hope it's a crappie. If it is, he's getting kept. No, it's a bass. Bass about a little bit smaller than the last, but just as beautiful. Whoop. 
Oh, 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 oh no, oh no, he threw my minnow. Oh, and Drew's messing me up. Drew! <laughs> I'm just kidding, thanks buddy. Look at that fish, guys. Another little largy. Right there, about in the same spot as that last one, right in his lip. Ah, oh, such a beautiful little fish. These guys are good eating too, but just for the sport of it. Be free. Just got drilled, guys, and he's running with it like there's no tomorrow. I have a feeling this might be a better fish or something. No. I don't know. He's feisty, whatever he is. It's a basser. Do a jump. Do it. Do it. Do it. He wants to. He's trying. Nope. There he goes. <laughs> That's all he had for us. Oh my gosh, he's a chunk. You one of those guys over there blowing up on the bank? Goodness. Looks like one of them Florida strain largies that have been stocked in here. It's so dark and pretty. Later, dude. still there oh i'm telling you guys it does it, it, fishing's fun but sometimes you just got to go back to your roots and men on a bobber and this stuff is fun it's a chilly december day in arkansas not too chilly so we're freezing to death but coming out here we're catching better on minnows and lures we're not catching to keep mostly unless we catch the crappie but we're still having fun so we'll let this guy go Turn around the other way. Oh, he wanted to come back to me. It's okay, buddy. We'll go that way. I'll catch you again later, I promise. Yeah. Got a bobber down, guys. He's hooked. And he's wrapped up and he broke me off. Dang old dang. Oh, he didn't break me. Yeah, he broke me off. <laughs> Thought I got hit? Yeah, I got hit. Got him. What is that? Is that a crappie? That's a crappie, bro. Oh, yeah. No, it ain't. It's a little bass. What are you doing trying to eat that minnow? That's clearly way too big for you. Are you even hooked? Of the slightest. Well, at least I get to reuse my minnow, maybe. A little largy. Boop. Nowhere near the size we're looking for, but we like. Fish of all of all kinds and sizes. Mess my bobber up, but that's okay. It wouldn't be very much of a bobber if it didn't mess up, right? Oh man. We're hooked up guys. I wasn't ready for that one. I think we're about to have a bass tat. Oh Drew's getting eight too. I think he's got Drew, I don't know. I caught a bass though, guys. Look at that. Can I be a professional now? Will y'all give me a boat? Can I have a boat, please? I can catch bass, see? Alright, later, dude. The last hooky structure. Oh. Look at that, that's a future 10 pounder. He ate that minnow, guys. How about he just engulfed it? Oh, he gone. Got a dead minnow on. I think he ate that minnow while it was dead, anyways. I'm gonna throw it back in there. Oh, there's another one. Oh, he broke my line. He broke my line, guys. He broke my <laughs> dead or alive. I don't think I landed near a bush. I'm gonna throw it in there anyway. See what happens. Oh, 
guy. Little guys. Yeah. <laughs> Your minnow's barely hanging on, eh? Nice. Oh, Drew. Oh, he was better. Damn. Should have got him longer. He got the rest of that one. At least I made that middle half. Like four or five feet. <laughs> I'm going to catch that fish now. Keep your head down. Give him a dang little depression cast. It's close, but I don't know if it's going to be good enough for him. Oh, it was good enough for him. Oh. Playing peekaboo with the same fish. Now Drew's going to get on him and catch him. Unless I cross over his line and get in there and spook him. He just wanted mine. Yep. Bag <laughs> Got a fresh minnow. <laughs> I know, he stopped. He didn't want mine no more. He said, this is too much pressure. I'm out here. He's all up in you now, buddy. I'm sorry. <laughs> like a two -pounder, <laughs> He's a lot better than what it was. Drew's got finally a decenter fish of the day. Oh, Johnny Drew! Johnny Look at that fish, guys. That's like a three. That, that's a three, broski. Oh, I'm, I got one. I had one, too. Oh, yeah, that's three. Okay. That's a three pound. Show it to me. Show the camera, Drew. Show, that, show me that. Show me that. Show. Hey, he's probably two. I give him three. Two. I give him two and a half. It's a good one. Yes, sir. One second. Strap y'all back in. I got a fish too, guys. He's trying. Oh, he let go. I try. Oh, he came off. He was diddle. I saw him flash. I give him A for effort. This minnow's been used and abused. Just like me. Oh. Immediately. <laughs> he hit it like he wanted. I thought he going to be all big. Getting eight guys. Oh, he's a monster. He is huge. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna laugh when a ten pounder comes up and tries to eat one of these little guys. He's just fighting away. Look at him guys. He's trying so hard. Oh there we go. Oh, you got it pretty good, guys. Just got it down the hatch. Pretty sure these are Florida strain largemouth that have been stocked in this pond. There's Arkansas strain in here, too. But uh, this pond has magnolia crappie and Florida strain largies in it. So I like this pond a lot. So let me get this guy unhooked. There we go. Pretty 
So dark. Later, buddy. And the minnows. Thank you for getting that, guys. Something was happening up there. Just weird stuff. My bobber's all funky. Oh, I got no minner. Oh, there's a fish, guys. Got my bobber all messed up, but it's a fish. This fish has been over here giving Drew a hard time, so I had to reach in there and catch it for him. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, we got into a couple bass, no crappie, no monster. Drew caught a pretty good fish though, and it was good for, you know, just an outing on a pond with minnows. Uh, all we were using was four pound monofilament line, so that always makes the one and two pound bass fight so much better. If you guys like what you saw, like and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned till next time. There will be better and more action packed videos in the future. Till then.